Assalamu alaikum and a very good morning to all of you. Hope you all are doing well. Welcome back with a brand new topic. Chapter number one of T2 series linear equations and graphs. A topic without which all your calculations about graphs are useless. So let's go in. Our objectives are first of all we will look at what linear equations are then I will talk to you guys about the general forms of all linear equation we will describe about different parts of a linear equation and then we'll talk about slopes where we will discuss different application of slopes around us so let's start I'm going to share a link with all of you you can see the screen in front of you first of all we will talk about linear equations the topmost question and the topmost part of our chapter that's linear equation and graph. So, first of all, what is a linear equation? Linear equation is an equation in which our x variable has a power 1. You can see on your screen that here we have some examples of linear equation. In some linear equations, may a cheese common. What is common hai ki in sub mein kya hai ek unknown variable hai. You can see that we have an x over here, we have an x over here, we have a y, we have y and an x. You can see that we have unknown variables here. What does y and x represent? y and x represent any unknown value. Linear equations, agar aap word linear ko search karte in a dictionary, you will see that the word linear actually means straightforward, simple, straight, one direction. So basically linear equations are those equations in which our variable that is the x or a y or a z, any letter has a power 1. What do I mean by that? x to the power 1 is basically x. What does this power 1 actually mean? This power 1 actually means that there is x one time. x a the power. What will happen if there is power 2? Agar power 2 ho x ki to kya ho jayega? x square ka matlab kya hota ki x kya hai? 2 times. Do the power x multiply ho hai. So linear equations is, are basically those equations in which all the variables have a power 1. What about equations such as x square plus 2? x square plus 2 is not a linear equation. These are different sort of equations known as quadratic equation. Why? Because if we have a board, we have x ki power 2 hai. 1 nahi hai. These are some examples of linear equation and this is what basically a linear equation is. Now, if we look at it carefully, we have two things, y and an x. Think about it. Have you ever heard these two variables before? Have you ever heard about a graph? What are the two axes of a graph? Yes, you have arrived at the right place. We have two axes. One is known as our x-axis and the other is known as the y-axis. So what we can do is we can use this linear equations or have different values we can use and then we can draw a graph draw a graph. Remember that linear equations ki graph is always straight line. Or the linear graph or linear equations when you draw a graph on any graph, then it will go straight up jayegi. either it will come straight down either straight up or straight down either straight up straight down straight up or just straight but it will never be a humpy dumpy line this line kabhi bhi nahi hogi our linear graphs will always be a straight line kabhi bhi अगर हम equations को use करते हैं और एक line draw करते हैं linear graph की तो हमारे पास हमेशा या तो बिल्कुल straight line होगी या तो बिल्कुल straight up जाएगी line 
बिल्कुल स्ट्रेट डाउन जाएगी स्ट्रेट अप जाएगी स्ट्रेट डाउन जाएगी जाएगी या बिल्कुल स्ट्रेट रहेगी लेकिन कभी भी हम टी डी लाइन्स नहीं होंगी दिस इज आइडेंटिटी ऑफ अ लीनियर इक्वेशन लीनियर इक्वेशन के थ्रू हम क्या करेंगे डाटा निकालेंगे वैल्यूज निकालेंगे और जब हम ग्राफ प्लॉट करेंगे तो हमारे पास या तो बिल्कुल स्ट्रेट अप लाइन आएगी या बिल्कुल स्ट्रेट डाउन लाइन आएगी ना दिस वॉज समथिंग अबाउट लीनियर ग्राफ्स will come back to the graphs later because we have to go and we have to learn different stuff for knowing how to plot the graph how to deduce values from the graph now let's talk about the general form jitni bhi linear equations aapke aas paas hoti hain unka ek general form hai you can see the general form in front in front of it that is y is equals to mx plus b it's b here but normally it is known as to be c I call it C, but in this reference it is known as B. C is the most common letter found in many of the books. So you can follow C here. Now, y is equals to m x plus C. ये क्या है? What is this? अभी हम ऊपर यहाँ पे देख कर आए कि हमारे पास जितनी भी linear equations होती हैं, आपने यहाँ पे देखा y is equals to x plus one, five x equals to six plus three y. ये हमारे पास क्या linear equations हैं? जितनी भी लीनियर इक्वेशंस होती हैं वो एक जनरल फॉर्म के मुताबिक बनी हुई हैं वो जनरल फॉर्म क्या हमारे पास वाई इज इक्व टू एम एक्स प्लस सी एम एक्स प्लस सी जस्ट की दैट सी इन द माइंड ओके नाउ फॉर एग्जांपल अगर मेरे पास इक्वेशन है वाई इज इक्व टू टू एक्स प्लस वन तो यू कैन सी दैट हेयर दिस टू इज कमिंग इन प्लेस ऑफ एम एक्स इज बिलो द एक्स प्लस इज बिलो द प्लस एंड दिस वन इज कमिंग बिलो द सी सिमिलरली वाई जो है वाई के नीचे आ रहा है यू कैन सी दैट ऑल द इक्वेशन ऑल लीनियर इक्वेश स्पेसिफिकली आई एम डिंग अबाउट लीनियर इक्वेश ऑल लीनियर इक्वेश आर इन अ फॉर्म वाई इज इक्वल टू एम एक्स प्लस सी लेट सपोज के हमारे पास इक्वेशन ये भी नहीं है लेट सपोज वी हैव अ डिफरेंट इक्वेशन दैट इज वाई इज इक्वल टू फोर एक्स प्लस टू सो यू कैन सी हियर इट इज द सेम सिनारियो वाई इज बिलो द वाई इफ यू लुक एट द जनरल फॉर्म बट इन प्लेस ऑफ एम दिस टाइम आई एम हैविंग इन प्लेस ऑफ एम दिस टाइम आई एम हैविंग Four. So this time, in place of m, I'm having four, and in place of c, I'm having two. X ke niche x hai, plus ke niche plus hai, y ke niche y. So you can see that all the linear equations around us are in a general form. Y is equals to m x plus c. But the question is, what is m? What is c? Think about it. M. is actually known as the slope or the gradient or c jo hai isko hum kehte hain y intercept what are slopes slopes kya hote hain let's discuss about different examples of slopes around us have you ever gone to a mall have you ever gone to an airport do you have stairs in your house soch ke bataye जब भी आप जाते हैं मॉल्स के अंदर आपके हाथ में एक ट्रॉली होती है और आपको चढ़ना होता है सेकेंड थर्ड फ्लोर पर सो वट डू डू इज यू जस्ट गेट ऑन ऑन द एलिवेटर एंड जस्ट मूव आप कभी सोचा है कि एलिवेटर की शेप में होता है लेट सपोज द एलिवेटर इज इज इन दिस शेप तो ये टेरा पंज है दिस स्लैंडिंग एरिया दिस स्लैंडिंग शेप दिस स्टीपनेस इज नोन एज द स्लॉ कोई चीज़ जो टेढ़ी होती है हमारे आसपास उसे हम क्या कहते हैं उसे हम स्लोप्स कहते हैं वी लुक इन डिटेल इन द लेटर वाई 